Good morning. We are a couple from Bulgaria which travel the world by staying in a different city every month while working remotely. This month we are at Las Palmas de Gran Canaria, the largest city on the Canary Islands. To fully experience this beautiful island, we plan to see the dunes of Mas Palomas, hike to Roque Nubo, and make a road trip from Aguimes to Mogan. But first, let us show you everything worth seeing in Las Palmas and why not inspire you for your next holiday destination. Our Airbnb is close to the beach, so let's start there. When we first saw the beach, we were surprised by how many people are spending their winter holiday in the Canary Islands to get some nice weather and sunshine. This fine 3 km stretch of yellow sand is considered to be one of the world's best city beaches. The temperature today is 21 degrees Celsius as of most days, but when on the sun is 26. Yesterday we also did some swimming. At first the water was a little bit cold, but after a minute it felt ideal. On the other side of the beach, next to the beautiful auditorium, the waves are bigger and the surfers are flocking. If you look carefully, you will see Petya. Not. Before heading to Old Town, let's explore Santa Catalina Park. This is not your typical park, it has many open spaces and a waterfront. <laughs> I see an old friend here from Santa Cruz de Tenerife. From the cruise ship to the mall the hop on hop off bus. Actually, why not go to the mall and take a look from above? There are two hop on hop off buses now and underground under the big shade is a bus station. From here we can see the science museum and the beach is that way. We will need a bus to go to Old Town, it's uh, 5 km from the park. We got off the bus near a market, that's good because we are pretty hungry by now. <laughs> Nothing to eat here, just fruits and veggies. Let's use Google Maps to find something decent, maybe Italian. Non più trai farfaloni amoroso, notte giorno ti torno girano, delle belle torbando a riposo. Now we can properly explore the Gueta. Usually, we are not showing you a lot of museums, but this one is interesting. It's about Christopher Columbus. 
the entrance is on the side. In the next scenes you will see Christopher Columbus and the three ships which was used on the voyage when America was discovered. Next to Vegueta is Triana, another old neighborhood. Let's look around. This pedestrian street is the main shopping artery of Las Palmas. Let's finish our tour of Las Palmas by listening to some traditional folk music at Pueblo Canario. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.